This is the front wheel from a Boogaboo Chameleon 3, and today we're going to do a full disassembly of the wheel so that you can see how to replace various elements that might be damaged. The first part is to take out the axle, and you're going to need two screwdrivers with the CRV4 head. It's a six sided hexagonal head, and you can just insert it on either ends of the axle and screw out the axle. The first thing to come out will be the cap. The rest of the axle you can pull out. This is the way it's supposed to work. If you have been using your Boogaboo Chameleon 3 for a while, what might happen is that that axle has gotten lodged into the ball bearings, at which point you'll hopefully be able to screw off the cap, but then it'll be a lot of prying and forcing to get that axle out. If your ball bearings have been damaged, then the wheel will be loose on the axle, but the axle will be rusted inside the inner part of the ball bearing. Um, I don't have uh, that sort of wheel right here. I can make that kind of a video in the future, but essentially it's just a lot of elbow grease to get the axle out past these parts. You'll eventually be able to remove this uh, suspension system. And then um, if you have that, that second problem where the ball bearings have broken and you can get it out, then you can cut the inner part of the ball bearing off the axle to preserve the axle. But uh, perhaps in a future video we'll show that. In any case, that's how you remove the axle. And then you could remove the ball bearings just with a screwdriver like this, in case you need to replace them. And it would be the same on the other side. Moving on to the rest of the wheel, you have this locking button on the back side. Uh, this does sometimes break. It breaks uh, in the part where the white button slots onto the black um, rail, I suppose you could call it. And to remove this button, you're going to need a pair of pliers. You just want to extend the, it into the locking position, set the pliers underneath, and use them to force it up past that position. Like this. Then you can get this off eventually. There you go. There's the button. And under the button is a screw, and this allows you to access the top portion of the suspension system, if that is what you need to remove. You're going to need a uh, regular screwdriver, a Phillips I guess it is, since the flat one is the flathead. Screw out that screw. That allows you to uh, remove this rubber flap, because that screw is holding this rubber flap in place and then you can pull out the suspension elements. You have uh, these bars that attach to the outside of the axle, springs, and then this white bit itself, which uh, goes into these various points in order to tighten or loosen the suspension. So now you can swap out any of these parts as well. Okay, I'm gonna do a quick uh, reassembly of the wheel. that part back in and we're going to slot this rubber piece back in in the very back there's a, a, a slot where it goes and you're going to slot it in nice and tight and then you can re-screw it Okay, these pieces are side specific. The axle. 
axle on right away so it holds those suspension parts in place. Okay, last part is the locking button, and that's just a matter of putting it there and then using a little bit of force to push it down. And it should find its position again. So that's the full disassembly of the Boogaboo Chameleon 3 front wheel. We hope this video has been helpful for someone. If it has been, we ask that you subscribe as it helps us to continue making videos in the future. Thank you.